I think for me the future of social investment is very much around collaboration. There's a whole opportunity for us all to come together so that we can invest a lot more and have much more of an impact than what we have in the old traditional models, which is just about handing across money and not really understanding where that's going. Collaboration, we think that the more that funders and donors can work together and can pool their investments, the more likely we'll be able to tackle some of the large-scale problems that the world faces. To make it more inclusive, and when I say inclusive, I mean include everybody in it. I think that the future of social investment um, relies on uh, people being more responsible with the wealth. And also, by wealth I don't only mean the financial resources that they have, but also the wealth of knowledge that they have. It is those risky, innovative, out-of-the-box kind of interventions that philanthropic capital need to be used uh, for, which is where I think impact investing and social uh, capital really needs to be used for finding those kind of opportunities. The evolution, I think, would be a closing up of the gaps in that continuum of capital. As you have more startups in the pipeline that become viable, it will pull, draw grants and funding from those traditionally that are playing further down in the investment landscape. The future is more and more such people across the world getting involved in certain enterprises. You know, technology-based um, companies and social enterprises really scaling to a significant uh, way and particularly those in emerging markets here in Asia like India and Indonesia where you have very large populations to really build a very large you know, uh, company which could even be a unicorn in the future.